high rate of gun score helps you choose the most suitable pellet rifle for you. In this video, we'll learn how it works and how you can benefit from it. The pellet gun industry is obsessed with muzzle velocity, telling you that higher is better, but there's much more to selecting a pellet rifle than that. High muzzle velocity is great, but only if you can hit what you're aiming at. Hello, I'm Stephen Archer, the president of Archer Air Guns. Enjoyable pellet rifle shooting comes from being able to consistently hit your target. But all pellet guns are not the same. Some can be really tough to shoot well, while others are just naturals. My Rater Gun score helps you find the best air rifle for you. A low Rater Gun score indicates a rifle that's easy to shoot, while a high score means you need special skills or knowledge to succeed with that gun. You will find Rater Gun scores for every pellet rifle on the archerpelletguns.com site. Use these scores to compare models and make an informed purchasing decision. It's a unique feature of our online store that helps you to make the best choice. We also give you an online rate of gun score calculator to compare the scores of different pellet rifles with and without scopes. Adding a scope to your pellet gun will significantly reduce, that is improve, the rate of gun score of any air rifle, as you will find out. A rate of gun score of 5.0 or less identifies an excellent starter gun that allows almost any beginner to shoot well. These are the easiest guns to shoot. Almost any beginner will be able to enjoy shooting them. Most people will be happy with rate of gun scores between 5.1 and 7.0. Guns like this are easy to shoot accurately for a wide range of shooters. Scores between 7.9 and 9.0 indicate a rifle that's an enjoyable challenge to shoot. It requires some skill or special knowledge to be accurate. A rate of gun score above 9.1 means that this gun's an enjoyable challenge to shoot well. Special skills and knowledge are definitely required to shoot these pellet rifles accurately. So how is the rate of gun score calculated? It's a combination of many factors that influence the accurate shooting of a pellet rifle, based on my experience shooting rifles of all kinds over many years. Some of these factors are measurable, like the length and weight of the gun. Generally, long, heavy rifles are more difficult to aim than short, light ones. So a heavy rifle tends to have a high rate of gun score, meaning that it's harder for most people to shoot accurately. Other factors influencing the rate of gun score are very real, but can't be measured. These include the need for powerful spring pellet rifles to be held in a certain manner to allow for accurate shooting. You just can't grab hold of a high power spring pellet rifle anyhow and shoot well. There's a technique that needs to be learned and applied consistently to shoot these guns. It's called the artillery hold. Again, this leads to a higher rate of gun score as most shooters don't know this or can't consistently hold the gun correctly for accurate shooting. Everyone knows that fitting a scope improves shooting accuracy. So fitting a scope will usually lower the rate of gun score for any pellet rifle. But too high magnifications magnify the shooter's natural shake so much that it becomes difficult to hit the target, at least unless you're very experienced. So big, heavy, high magnification scopes will have a higher rate of gun score than a lighter, medium magnification scope. So that's it. Don't buy a pellet rifle without knowing its rate of gun score. Visit archerpelletguns.com and make your decision. Have fun, but shoot safe. Thanks for watching.